Here we come. Got him looking. Oh, man. Since arriving in Arlington in July of 2015, Jake Diekman has been a force, working out of the talented Rangers bullpen. At first glance, you wouldn't notice the six foot four inch lefty has been fighting a bowel disease since childhood. At age 11, he was diagnosed with ulcerative colitis, a condition that causes inflammation of the colon. It makes you super fatigued. You can get super dehydrated real fast. With medication and infusions, Jake was able to keep the condition relatively under control over the past 19 years, but it continued to get worse over time. I lost 20 pounds in about 10 days. When I went from 207 to 186, like that, that's when I knew uh, something was going on. Following an intense flare-up in December, doctors recommended Jake undergo a series of surgeries. The Rangers and like all my doctors back home, um, we figured that we should see the best surgeons in the country. In January, Jake underwent the first of three J pouch procedures at the Mayo Clinic in Minnesota. The first surgery was January 25th. We took out my entire colon. All right. Okay, what's happening right now? Well, we're done. I just got uh, discharged. This is great. Best day ever. How does it feel? Um, amazing. Right now, I feel like it's just a waiting game. I'll have another one April 12th is when it's scheduled. And then nine to 10 weeks after that, I'll have the last one where they reconnect everything. And then as soon as I can get into baseball shape, then I'm good. Hopefully, God willing, I'll never have to take a pill or an infusion ever again. Jake intends to rejoin the Rangers in the second half of the season when he is at full strength. I'll probably cry after my like, first outing. It'll mean the world because I've never really sat out this long ever in my entire career. During his time away, Jake's teammates will be pulling for him to make a speedy recovery. You know, we're all here for him, whatever he may need. And, you know, as long as he continues to, to do what the doctors are telling him and, you know, keeps his faith, he'll be, he'll be fine. We're a family here. We know that as soon as he's, you know, he's healthy and he's ready to go, he'll be back in the team and, you know, continue to help us to win games.